behold the power of an efficiency shovel. <laughs> oh, I love doing that. So, yeah, that's... Today's going to be the house building day. That's basically what this episode is going to be devoted to, is building the house. And it's going to be barrels of fun, and I'm going to have episode 18 up also because of reasons. And that will be up at 3 o'clock. Um, no Sims 4 today because Sims 4 just wasn't working the way that it's supposed to, and it's been really... Why can't I pick these up? It's just been really frustrating, and I got sick of, like, crash, restart, crash, restart, crash, restart. So I was like, yeah, we're going to move on from that. So I'm going to keep on doing this, and then I'm going to bring it back home, and I'm going to smelt it, and we're going to have lots of windows for our modern house. So that is what I will do. And I will see you guys very shortly. So I went and built the frame, and the reason why I did this off camera was because it was really boring. And it took a really long time to clear all of this clay, and you guys um, unfortunately missed out on the massive sea of clay blocks that were all over here. There must have been like a hundred of them, or more. Maybe like 300, I think, would be a good estimate, so... Yeah, I'm, I'm not gonna have the front door be in the front first floor of my house. It's gonna be, um... The front first floor does not make any sense. It's going to... I'm going to have, like, an upstairs, and the upstairs will have the front door, because I'm going to have a staircase that goes to the upstairs, but i got to do this first. Because this is fun. And I love the way that these windows look in this texture pack, because they kind of look, um... like those sandblasted or, like, foggy windows, and I think that's cool. Because I can still see outside. It's very pixelated, but I can still see outside. And I'm also going to, as time goes on, because I'm going to have to split this into a couple of videos, I am going to use Ija Minecraft's furniture mods that he did that are vanilla mods, by the way. So it's basically all with like one command block. And yeah, so we will we will have couches and lamps and things, and it will look really cool. I mean, I can make those things with, you know, regular Minecraft blocks, but I like the stylized stuff, too. Yeah, so that used up a full stack of windows. And so, yeah, and I think I had to go back and get a crap. Eh, I didn't want to bring two of them. I just want to bring one of them. Um... I really wish I had Silk Touch. Anyways, I, I did have to go and get some more quartz. And I'm definitely going to have to get more, too, as time goes on. Because, yeah, I'm not going to do a full quartz um, roof because that will drive me insane. I'm probably just going to do wood. I just wanted the white because I like the white lining and everything. And I'm just going to do this here so I have a doorway to get back in later on. Um... So, what's the next thing that I want to do? I'm not really sure. Uh, I think I'm going to build the um, upper part, and that's kind of going to be like an overhang here. So, I will see you guys when I have most of that completed. Okay, so this is the top part right here, and I'm just going to do my... Another quartz frame. Um, you don't belong there. Get off of there. Of course it fell. Of course it fell! Why wouldn't it fall? It's doing that to torture me. You know, look at it down there. It's like mocking me as it stares up at me like, Ha ha, you can't get me. You know you've been playing Minecraft too long when you feel like Minecraft blocks are mocking you. Um, it actually took me a really long time to figure out how I wanted to build this, which is kind of silly because it typically doesn't take me that long to figure out how to build a house. I usually have some pretty 
big house ideas, and I do so many modern houses in Sims 4 that you would think that I would be better at this. <laughs> but apparently not, and I am out of nether quartz. Except for that one little piece down there, which is mocking me. But... Just picture it done. Okay? Like, really, really, really finished. Like, the epitome of finished. Like, so finished that it's just the most amazing modern house ever. Is it just, like, the greatest house now because you pictured it finished? <laughs> so, um, yeah, I'm gonna do more stuff. And when I come back, more stuff will be done. So, see you in a bit. So, I got more nether quartz. <laughs> Yay. This is actually a real big pain in the butt for me to do, and it took me a long time, which is why I cut it out, because I was like, no. So anyways, yay, now I can actually, like, finish my roof, kind of. I can completely finish it, but at least get it to a point where it looks nice. And it looks like it makes sense. And I really hope I have enough blocks, and if I run out of blocks, I'm gonna be really mad. So this thingy here is probably going to have a glass roof. I don't th I, I was thinking of doing a glass roof for the bottom floor, but I think that's kind of weird. And that's probably more glass than I want to use. So yeah, by the way, um, I didn't have my noise gator on before I started the episode, and I kind of apologize for that, because I'm sure you heard a lot of static. It should be okay now. So anyways, you might still be able to hear my cat in the background, because my cat's always talking in the background of almost every video. Most of the time, you can't hear him. But he does do that, and I, I don't know why when my talking makes him need to talk, but it's almost like as if he's having a conversation with me. Whatever, Spike. You have fun with that. So you do this, and this, and... I don't really think I need this much, but... I'm wondering if I wanna do a glass floor. I don't think I do. Because I don't think it's going to look very good. <laughs> I can't build up this way. Let me build up over here. Um, this one, this one, this one. So I just want the glass roof so that I can look up and see the sun. Or the moon and the stars. And this will be my bedroom. And it will be very happy. So anyways, um, yeah, that, that's how it'll be. I mean, I, I, I am definitely a gamer. No two ways about it, but I, when it comes to my house building in Minecraft, I do have a more feminine approach, I think. Otherwise, I definitely play games the way that people would consider men play games, which really is just playing games well, but apparently that's... A masculine way to play a game because I guess women don't play games well or something like that you know ow I like how I'm talking about how women play games well and then I just like fall off the edge and take fall damage if this was a hardcore I'd be like but it's not so I'm, I'm having second thoughts about a glass floor I'm kind of not. Hmm. Um. How did that? How did I make everything go from my hot bar back into my thing? That was unique. I didn't know that was a thing that was possible. Whatever. So I I want to do half slabs. And I think half slabs will look better because I want to have the um, 
white peeking out from under the half slab, I think that will look really classy, and that's definitely not going to be enough half slabs. That will be, though. That will definitely be enough. And I will put you there, and <laughs> my inventory is so painfully full right now. This is really annoying. And eat my nom noms. And we are going to half slab it up. This is probably going to take a while, too. Placing half slabs has always been a really annoying thing. I don't know why. It just is. From the dawn of Minecraft, this has always been really annoying. And it's only until very recently, I think it was... I don't even remember what update it was that we could now place half slabs on either the top or bottom half of a support block because it took a long time for us to be able to do that. I mean, I'm sure, you know, veteran Minecraft players, if you remember way back when, the way that we had to get upside down stairs and the way that we had to get, you know, half slabs to be placed like this and how annoying it was. And I still place the half slabs that way. And it's just too complicated to do that from down below, so I'm going up here. But yeah, that was a really hard thing, and I didn't like it that way, and I was so happy when they fixed it. But half slabs are still a pain in the butt. And I don't know if maybe it's because of the um, crosshairs for conquest are so tiny that I can't see them half the time, so I can't see where I'm actually pointing the block. And this is such a high-res um, texture pack that I can't really see the outline very well. Like, in the video, you can see it much more clearly, but when I'm playing the game, I can't actually see it right now, so it's kind of odd. Oh, by the way, um, I'm not actually recording audio separate from gameplay right now. I'm actually recording and playing at the same time. And I really don't sound any different. So, yeah. In case anybody was wondering or thinking that I might not be, like, capturing genuine moments, um, I'm the same either way, which is good, I guess. Um, it's just that, yeah, I, I have a computer mouse and I finally got a, a mouse pad for it and you can't hear the clicking of this mouse because it is that quiet. So, yeah. I mean, if I hold the mouse up to the microphone at some point, like, I'm not going to do it right this second, but if I hold the mouse up to the microphone, you'll hear the clicking, I'm sure, but um, you won't hear it otherwise. So yeah, this is going to take a while, and I'm still going to have to go down below in order to um, place all of the ones that I haven't placed in all the places where I can't go because of the cliff, but I really do want this to look like it's built into the cliff, and where I am right now is going to be kind of like a deck. I said deck, as in your, the deck to your backyard, I didn't say the other kind of deck. Okay. Clear your minds. Anyways, this will be like a deck so that you can... I don't... Oh, I don't know. Grill. <laughs> we, we should have a grill. I'm sorry, but we need to have a backyard grill in Minecraft. Not like a furnace, but a grill. For grilling food. Because who wouldn't want to do that? Like grill steaks from your livestock and your backyard. I mean, that's just like the most fun thing in the world in Minecraft. Who wouldn't want to do that? And that needs to be a mod. Why isn't it a mod? Somebody needs to make that a mod. If you, if you don't make it a mod, I will be angry at you. Like, I don't even know who you are, but I will be angry at you, so you'd better make that a mod. Anyways. This shouldn't take too much longer, I hope. So, plunk, 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 plunk. I'd love to know how Notch and Jeb chose all of the sounds 
in Minecraft for placing blocks and picking up blocks because they're really pleasant sounds and I love to listen to them. And do that right there and that. So this should be kind of easy-ish. Ish. There'll be a lot of ish, that's for sure. Not Irish, just ish. I tend to add the word ish to the end of sentences. Like, do you guys have a particular little um, suffix that you use, like ish or something similar to it, that you stick at the end of words or sentences to make it, to convey a specific meaning? Because I do that very often. And I don't know why that fascinates me when other people do that. It just does. You know, I have this thing for linguistics, so, yeah. And by the way, when I was, um, my, when I first started studying at the university that I go to, I was considering studying, um, anthropology with an area of study in linguistics in addition to early childhood education, and then I switched to studio art painting. Because of reasons, I really just run out of half slabs. <sighs> Dearest half slabs, you suck. That should be enough. Yeah, I, that if I run out now, I'm going to be really unhappy. It, it will be very unhappy universe. The universe will be so unhappy that the unhappiness will just make the universe very unhappy. And we want a happy universe. You know, we really do. So I don't even know what I'm going to put in it. That's, that line is going to really drive me insane. Um, I want to get these out of the way because I want to do, I want to do my floor. Get, break. Torch. Ah, you torch, I don't like you. I hate all of you. I sound like one of the characters in Game of Thrones when they get mad. I sound like Stas Baratheon. Um, by the way, if you guys have watched season 5 of Game of Thrones all the way through, um, I'm not gonna spoil it. I was going to say something about Stannis, but I'm not going to spoil it because I don't really want to spoil it for people because that wouldn't be fair, would it? And people get mad about spoilers. Or, you know, I could just say it and, like, warn you ahead of time before I say it and then, you know, ex tell you to just, like, mute it so you don't have to hear it. Because you can still see what I'm doing in the video even though I'm talking. Um, so, spoiler alert. I don't feel bad for Stannis at all. And I don't think anybody feels bad for him. So anyways, moving on from that. You can turn your sound back on. You know, because if you ever sound off and I say to you, you can turn your sound back on, you can totally hear what I'm saying. Um, anyways. So, I probably won't even put in an annotation, so you could just be, like, sitting here for the rest of the episode with your sound muted and you're like... I wonder if she's still talking about it yet. I should probably turn my sound back on, but I don't want to hear any spoilers, so I'm in a weird paradox right now, and it's very upsetting. Um, so, yeah, I'm a little tired. I don't know why I'm tired. I actually do know why I'm tired, because I slept weird, but... Yeah, like, I fixed my bed, and then I started sleeping weird. And it's funny, because I have bursitis in my left hip, so... I mean, it's not funny to have bursitis in your left hip, but... Yeah, I sleep really good on, like, the floor, but with pers with the persitis, um, it's actually really painful for me to sleep on the floor, but I still fall asleep. I know that makes absolutely no sense, absolutely no sense but my brain loves it. So, <laughs> my hip doesn't, but my brain does. So that's, that's what happens in my life. <laughs> I'm 28 and I have persitis in my left hip, among other problems. So... I think I am going to split this episode in half, and the other half will be up later on today at 3 o'clock, and in that half we will be doing 
the floor, and other things that will be fun. And then we'll resume with our life. So thank you guys very much for watching, and I will see you in the next episode. Your support of this series is greatly appreciated. To help keep this Let's Play alive, go ahead and click anywhere on the screen to watch the next episode.